The opposition scored sustained pressure for reforms at the electoral body, so it filed a petition to oust the nine commissioners at the National Assembly. Subsequently, the Speaker directed the Justice and Legal Affairs Committee to scrutinize the petition and respond within 10 days. But the man at the center of this storm seems, seems unperturbed. Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission Chairman Isaac Hassan says he is willing to vacate office if Parliament backs ODM petition to oust him and his team. That's an issue which is before Parliament and the, the coalition is using the, the legal process for removing the commissioners. So I think the matter is in Parliament. The commission has filed uh, its response. And let's wait for the committee of parliament to make his report. He was speaking on the sidelines of the Commonwealth Electoral Network Conference that was opened in Nairobi this morning with representatives from 53 states attending. This is a very, I think as the Secretary General has said in his uh, remarks, this is a very important forum for Commonwealth Election Commissions to come together and share experiences and learn from each other. This is actually to his own personal initiative to set up this network to enable uh, election bodies from the Commonwealth to come and uh, talk to each other. Also in attendance was the Commonwealth Secretary General Kamale Shama, Attorney General Gidu Mwigai, among other dignitaries. Awarolero reporting for Channel One Lunchtime News.